So I apologize in advance, I am very, very sick. You can hear just in the tone of my voice, but I wanted to make this video nonetheless. Um, <clears throat> so for those of you who don't know, I've made a lot of videos on my channel, this channel. I've made a lot of past videos talking about advice on a bunch of different topics, relationships, abuse, you know, things like that. And I have an email set up as mrrepsion at gmail.com right here. People can send me stuff, video ideas, whatever they want to send me, right? Well, this morning when I woke up, I received an email from someone, and upon reading it, I read all of my emails, I just can't respond to them all. Upon reading this particular email, it was from a 14-year-old girl who asked to remain anonymous, and she was asking my advice on how to prepare for when she has a child, because she wants to have sex, she's 14, and she wants to get pregnant. Now, from the email that I read, she's not currently pregnant, but she's trying to get pregnant, and she's 14, and she wants, and she's having sex with a young 15-year-old male. Now, upon reading this, it just kind of shocked me that a girl would be asking me, of all people, um, how to get ready to have a child, since I obviously don't have any children. But I guess what was just shocking to me is the realization that girls want to get pregnant at this young of age, 14. I mean, I'm not going to sit here and say who you can't and cannot have sex with based upon your age. Well, within within reason, obviously. But uh, I just like to say to you, the girl who wrote me that, that, that email, um, I was going to respond to you via typing, but I figured that it would be better to make a video since you obviously watch my videos, that... Um, I don't think that you are mentally, psychologically, financially, or any type of illy with an L-Y at the end, ready to have a child. Um, you're 14. I'm not going to tell you who you can sleep with or who you can be in love with, but I just want to urge you to think carefully about the decision you're making right now because... I feel as if our society today likes to um, pressure women and men into having children at a young ages. And this is not only very bad, because you are not financially ready to support a child, and your 15-year-old boyfriend or the guy you're sleeping with is not ready to financially to support a child. And having a child is a lot of work. I'm almost 21 years old. I turned 21 on December 5th. And I don't even want, th want to think of having a child and probably till I'm 27, 28 years old. And I I'm almost half your age. <coughs> or I mean, yeah, halfway your age, whatever. Um, but think about the decision you're making because if you have a child at 14, it's going to be a permanent thing. Um, I think... I don't know how many people watch The Amazing Atheist, but he made a video titled... Um, Hey, Honey Boo Boo, I'm sure you guys heard of the new Honey Boo Boo uh, TV show that's up there on rea it's a reality TV show of this mother and her raising her daughter and putting her daughter up like a, a doll and putting her up on stage to go up and modeling and stuff, and she's only like five years old or whatever. I feel as if our society today is putting pressure on young girls to get pregnant, have children, and then use their children as a means of um, style, as a means of fashion, as a means of of showing off. And this is wrong. This is purely disgusting, repulsive mentality. And that's not... You don't want a child to show off your child. You're 14. You don't want a child... You don't want to have a child only to show them off, you know? There's so much more to children than just dolling them up with makeup, putting them on national television, and then making them dance lo and look like a model, and wear pinups and trying to show off their so-called breasts, even though they don't even really have any at that age. Um, it's just disgusting. And society today... <coughs> society today has really developed this concept of let's have children... Um, because it's, uh, because it's stylish, because it makes you look cool, or, you know, your, your daughter is a little toy that you can play around with. No, your daughter is a human being. Your daughter needs to be brought up with a parents who love them, not 
dolling him up like Barbie and then putting him on television. And I, I know I'm getting off topic with the television and stuff, but it's the same logic here to this, for, to this anonymous 14-year-old girl I'm talking to here. Don't have a child for that reason because it's fashionable or because it's stylish. I mean, that's what society is pushing on us right now. And if you want to have a child, I'm not going to tell you don't have one, but I will tell you to think about your decision you're making because having a child is a very big responsibility. One responsibility that I myself, and I'm financially ready, I'm financially prepared. I could support a child if I wanted to make one. I could stick my Twinkie in that peach, pop out a child, and voila, I'd have a little mini, mini Repsion running around. And I could support him, but I don't want that yet. Because I just know that I'm not mentally ready and mature enough to spend time and, and give that child the time and love it deserves from only being 20 years old. I'm just not in that position yet to start a family. So please, you're not financially ready to raise a child. Your boyfriend isn't. Um, I ask you, just think about your decision. Please do not... I. I I don't want to sound like I'm trying to force you to do anything, but I'm just, I'm, I really don't want you to have a child and then neglect that child um, based upon not being, having the finances to support him or, or giving the love and care that that child will deserve because it deserves a lot more than you think. A lot more than a dog, a lot more than a rabbit, and a lot more than a cat. It's a human being. And when you create that human being, you got to take care of it. So, thank you for watching. I'm Mr. Repsion, and I don't know, i probably not going to make a video for a couple few days um, based upon how sick I am. So, this video was already a hell to make on my throat. So, thank you for watching.